the field and uh, what you're going to wear and uh, how you're going to look on TV. But when you're actually a player at the school, it, it really doesn't matter anymore because you're thinking about what the opposing offense is going to do to you or what the defense is going to do to you. Uh, try not to look bad on the field. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Was it eight tackles last week? Great one, I think. I don't know. You tell me. I don't know. Yep. Yeah. So does your does your body feel different after eight tackles versus you know sixteen tackles or whatever you had those those games when you're making a huge number of tackles? You know when What's you ask me, when you ask me that about my body, man, I got this terrible turf burn on my knee. Oh, really? Yeah, I think that's the worst one. But <laughs> but other than that, nah, I mean. Our strength, staff, our strength staff does a great job of getting us back right for the next week. I mean, of course, game day, we have our nicks and bruises, but uh, getting ready for the next week, we feel better. Rick, do you, you guys feel like after the last two weeks, defense has, for one of another word, to get back on track a little bit? I mean, you know, you got gashed a couple of times by a couple of running quarterbacks. Hacking Burt's not that kind of guy. <laughs> but <clears throat> what, what do y'all need to get straightened out, I guess, before you move on? Uh, get, get better every week, you know. Uh, every offense is going to try to do something different to us. I think coming in, they had like three quarterbacks that were eligible to start or whatnot, Maryland. So uh, the guy that we were thinking that was going to start and didn't start, and they brought out the running quarterback. And his speed was receiving. I got to tip my hat to him. Uh, we took some angles that he outran, and I just got to give him his props. He did a great job. And, uh, where do you think y'all are from a progression standpoint as a defense, so playing well together and stuff? I mean, are people going to look at those – couple of runs by Diamont and Hills and maybe get the wrong impression about you guys or you know what I mean where, where do you think y'all are from the standpoint of improving I mean you know it's only, it was only challenge, you know? yeah it was only the sixth game of the season I mean we we plan to be playing a lot more football so uh yeah. just uh one third of, through the season I, I think that we're at where we need to be where we need to be but we steadily need to progress if we want to uh, get to where we want to be how many as, a, as the middle linebacker in this defense, how many tackles a game do you think you should make? I mean, that was a good 50? question. I like that. <laughs> that was a good question. How many, think, how many tackles should I make? Uh, how many tackles? All of them. That I think any tackle that I'm in the area or, or near a guy, I think I should make the tackle. I think I shouldn't miss any. I think that's a better answer for it. I don't think I should miss any. How many have you missed this year? Uh, Four or five. Yeah, Six games, that's pretty good. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Christian, uh, Christian. <laughs> the standard you hold yourself by is basically whatever it is you think you should make every play that comes in your area. Yeah, I think I should make the play. And uh, even on extra effort plays, I, I don't think I should miss the tackle. Any. I think when I miss the tackle, I feel, I feel like uh, I did something wrong. So, yeah. Christian Hackenberg, uh, you saw him last year. You know he's coming into the stadium. And high uh, draft pick, supposedly. Uh, what do you see in him? What stands out about uh, playing a guy like that? Uh, you know, Christian Hackenberg is a very talented guy. I mean, I looked across the ball from him last year, uh, making checks against him. But, uh, you know, him, like you say, he's a, supposed to be a high draft pick, and he's been playing like that uh, recently. But, you know, we just got to see we just got to see what they try to do to us and how our coach thinks they're going to scheme us up. and. Uh, make adjustments throughout the week. But I think he runs his offense well, and he's a team leader on that team. And Coach Franklin does a